What if someone told you they'd give you $100 if you could define the word furniture? It seems like it should be easy. Oxford defines it as objects that can be moved, that are put into a house, and that make it more suitable for living in. But there are some big problems with that definition, like what about a ceiling fan? It can be moved, you put it in a house, and it does make it more suitable for living in. But most people would agree a ceiling fan isn't furniture, maybe a fixture. I don't think this is a shortcoming of the word furniture, but really a problem with language itself. Like, why is it that these inflated sacks of rubber are called balls, but this inflated sack of rubber is a balloon. It feels like words should refer to concrete, fixed sets of objects that everyone agrees on, but words are abstractions, and the real world totally defies the neat linguistic categories we try to impose on it. So do you think you'd be able to come up with a definition for furniture, or is that contest impossible?